This room is free. Okay. Paige, your pediatrician on call, please. Okay. Yeah, what happened with Trevor? My son's health is none of your concern. David, stop. Tend to your patients, doctor. Stay away from my son. My son developed a high fever after being dumped in an alley, exposed to the elements, cared for by a woman who knows nothing about babies. You bet your ass I wanted a full examination to make sure my son survives your incredibly stupid plan. How are you? You're right, do you need anything, anything at all? I'm okay. Why don't you go back to work, doctor? I'm talking to my wife, okay? My, my wife. Yeah, well, marriages end all the time. But a mother and child, now that's a bond that lasts forever. We should really get our son home. If I could just have a few minutes with Jake. We really don't have a few minutes, Amanda. It's almost time for his next feeding. Shall we? Water, tea? I'm fine. How about some dinner? You really haven't eaten much today. I, I'm fine. Well, you look tired. Why don't you go get some rest? I'll take the baby. Amanda, he's my child. We're family. You know, he's been really fussy all day. I just don't want to upset him. I will be careful, okay? Maybe later. Amanda, I've dreamed about this. Holding my baby, talking to him, looking in his eyes and telling him how much I love him. Don't you think it's time that our son got to know his father? Come here, buddy. Hey, you. Hey. It's me. Your father, that's right. <laughs> My son. promise you, I will be there for your first steps, for your first day at school, to hear about your first kiss. How about that, huh? <laughs> I've waited for you my whole life, and I will be there, I promise, every day for the rest of my life to love you, to protect you, and raise you up to be a better man than I will ever be. I promise you that. Every day for the rest of my life, to, to love you, to protect you, and raise you up to be better man than I will ever be. I promise you that. Everything all right? He went right to sleep. Great. What I meant is everything all right with the nursery. Well, it's the best of everything, so nothing to complain about. And how about your room? You need anything? Nope, it's great. I want you to be comfortable. Amanda, I know that's not going to be easy given the way I behaved. But to learn that Jake had been lying to me all that time about my son... Jake that... was only doing what I wanted him to. Pulling a gun was clearly all Jake. He really loves you. I really love him. It's good to have love in your life. Is that what this is? Forcing me to stay here with the baby, someone to love? I'm doing this because I believe our son deserves to have both his parents in his life. And I'm hoping someday you'll agree. <laughs>